Hi and welcome back to Free Science Lessons. By the end of this video, you should be able to represent the electronic structure of elements. You should then be able to use this to work out the group number of an element in the periodic table. In this topic, we've been looking at atomic structure, and I'm showing you here the structure of an atom of helium. We can work out the structure of the helium atom by looking at the symbol for helium. Remember that the smaller of the two numbers is called the atomic number. The atomic number tells us the number of protons in the nucleus, so we can see that there are two protons in the nucleus of helium. Now the atomic number also tells us the number of electrons. That's because in a neutral atom, the number of electrons is the same as the number of protons. So this means that a helium atom also has two electrons. Now electrons exist in energy levels. These are sometimes called electron shells, and you can see that in the exam if you want. Each energy level can hold a maximum number of electrons before the next energy level starts filling. Now I should point out that you only need to work out the electron energy levels of the first 20 elements in the periodic table. The first energy level can hold a maximum of 2 electrons, and the second energy level can hold a maximum of 8 electrons. The third energy level can also hold a maximum of 8 electrons before the next energy level starts filling. So let's look at how we assign electrons into energy levels. I'm showing you here the symbol for the element hydrogen. Hydrogen atoms have one electron, so we place that electron in the first energy level like this. We can also show that hydrogen atoms have one electron in their first energy level by writing a 1 in brackets. OK, the next element is helium. As we've seen, helium atoms have two electrons, and we find both of these electrons in the first energy level. And again, we can show this by simply writing a 2 in brackets. The next element is lithium, which has three electrons. As you can see, lithium atoms have two electrons in their first energy level. That means that the first energy level is now full, so the third electron goes into the second energy level. Again, we can show this by writing a 2 followed by a 1 in brackets. OK, here's another key fact. The number of electrons in the outer energy level tells us the group number of that element in the periodic table. And in the periodic table, the groups are the vertical columns. Lithium has one electron in its outer energy level, and lithium is in group 1. Beryllium is the next element in the periodic table. Beryllium has two electrons in the first energy level and two electrons in the outer energy level, and beryllium is in group 2. Boron has two electrons in the first energy level and three electrons in the outer energy level, and boron is in group 3. OK, I'd like to draw the electron energy levels for the element carbon. Carbon has six electrons in total, so pause the video now and try this yourself. OK, carbon has two electrons in the first energy level and then four electrons in the outer energy level and carbon is in group 4. I'm showing you here the element neon. Neon has two electrons in the first energy level, and then eight electrons in the outer energy level. Now the second energy level can hold a maximum of eight electrons, so that means that neon has a full outer energy level. Elements with a full outer energy level are found in group 0 of the periodic table. Scientists call group 0 the noble gases, and you need to learn that. Both helium and neon have a full outer energy level, and both of these elements are found in group 0. OK, here's the element sodium. Sodium has 11 electrons. Sodium atoms have two electrons in the first energy level, and then eight electrons in the second energy level. This means that the second energy level is full, so sodium atoms have one electron in the third energy level, and sodium is in group 1. You'll find plenty of questions on this topic in my vision workbook, which you can get by clicking on the link above.